My name is uh, Imran Kunalan. I'm the Director for Talent Division from uh, Multimedia Development Corporation of Malaysia. So, what is uh, MDEC about? Perhaps you can share about that. So, MDEC is the custodian for IT and IT related uh, companies. So, we are the agency under the Ministry of Science, Technology and Innovation. We are looking at uh, the developing the economy through the ICT mm -hmm. as an enabler. And we oversee the development of uh, MSC status companies. Uh, within Malaysia and that comprises of uh, foreign IT companies as well as locally uh, groomed uh, IT companies. Okay. We understand that MTEC uh, has a big role to play yeah. in this event. So uh, from your perspective, how has the event been so far? From, from my point of view, the event is, I think it's, it's very uh, encouraging to see the number of participants, especially since this is talking about uh, digital education. So we see a wide range of participants, not only from the industry's point, uh, companies promoting their products, but at the same time, we have a lot of knowledge sharing sessions from the subject of the experts in terms of education and learning. So we see uh, participants from the uh, educators, from the schools, as well as the tertiary level. So as we know, this event covers the end-to-end -end continuum of learning and education. So it covers both the primary as well as tertiary. So I'm pleased to see that uh, we are seeing a lot of teachers as well as lecturers coming to attend these sessions. Okay. We know that Digital Education Show will definitely return in 2014 and of yes. course it's an annual event. So yep. what is your vision for this event in the future? I think one of the, the key learnings is more on the education, education landscape is changing because if you had been following the sessions, one of the sessions was about what the students want from the teachers and from the education system, which is very much enlightening to see what is the expectation of the students or the, the learning communities. So what I would like to see, this is, a, I would say, it's a beginning. As I mentioned, the education landscape is changing. The same mode of teaching and learning cannot be applicable now. So a lot of technology-driven education and learning is happening. The educators need to be aware of parents need to be aware of as well as the kids because for the kids it's not about the gadgets how you use the gadgets to enhance your knowledge is very important so as far as I'm concerned for a start this is an eye-opener and for the future is we, we expect to see more and more participation from the educators sharing the best practices of learning and teaching that will impart the right knowledge for the kids to grow and develop and pursue the right career in whatever field they want to be. Okay, well said. Um, we understand that this event is also uh, in line with uh, the Ministry's uh, education blueprint. Yes. So what is your vision for Malaysia's education sector as a whole? I think specifically on its uh, process and progression for digital learning. Okay, uh, you're very right in terms of saying that this is, for me, this is pretty much aligned to the transformation that's happening in the education environment in Malaysia. So we have the education blueprint which has taken a lot of feedback from the communities, from parents, from kids, or even the educators and so forth. But when we talk about changing the way uh, and knowledge is transferred, so digital learning plays a big role because we see the, the pervasive use of technology in teaching and learning. So learning can happen from any mode. So gone are the days when you only have the whiteboard or even the blackboard. So nowadays if you ask for the kids, so they are using smart boards now and they, most of them already tech savvy. They have their iPod, they have their iPads and so forth. So I believe this is very much in line in the transformation that's happening. So when we talk about how the knowledge can be imparted from the traditional methods but to a, a more interactive and, and fun learning environment because kids nowadays don't want to be in a stereotype of learning environment. So I believe this conference and the, and the information that has been shared from the industry, from the educators, from the subject experts is very, very relevant and which is very much in line that will complement to the blueprint that we have created. So where the pedagogy of teaching, how teaching happens can be tweaked and change with the environment that we are in.